When you are asked if you can do a job, tell them, certainly I can. Then get busy and find out how to do it. Doing what you love, is the cornerstone of having abundance in your life. Enjoy the little things, for one day you may look back and realize, they were the big things. Gratitude can transform common days into thanksgivings, turn routine jobs into joy, and change ordinary opportunities into blessings. When you are grateful, fear disappears, and abundance appears. Your work is going to fill a large part of your life, and the only way to be truly satisfied is to do what you believe is great work. And the only way to do great work is to love what you do. It's not what you achieve, it's what you overcome. That's what defines your career. Find out what you like doing best, and get someone to pay you for doing it. Just one small positive thought in the morning, can change your whole day. Your job is not just to do what your parents say, what your teachers say, what society says, but to figure out what your heart calling is, and be led by that. Gratitude is a powerful process for shifting your energy and bringing more of what you want into your life. Be grateful for what you already have, and you will attract more good things. You can only become truly accomplished at something you love. Don't make money your goal. Instead, pursue the things you love doing and then do them so well that people can't take their eyes off of you. The secret of joy in work is contained in one word, excellence. To know how to do something well is to enjoy it. I think the foremost quality, there's no success without it, is really loving what you do. If you love it, you do it well, and there's no success if you don't do well what you're working at. To be successful, the first thing to do, is fall in love with your work. Work to become, not to acquire. The price of success is hard work, dedication to the job at hand, and the determination that whether we win or lose, we have applied the best of ourselves to the task at hand. If you love your work, if you enjoy it, you're already a success. Just don't give up trying to do what you really want to do. Where there is love and inspiration, I don't think you can go wrong. Pleasure in the job, puts perfection in the work. Whenever things go a bit sour in a job I'm doing, I always tell myself, you can do better than this. Leave your ego at the door every morning, and just do some truly great work. Few things will make you feel better than a job brilliantly done. There is a lot of stuff we can't control, but it is completely in our power to decide what the definition of a good job is. That's up to us. Concentrate all your thoughts upon the work in hand. The sun's rays do not burn until brought to a focus. Opportunity is missed by most people, because it is dressed in overalls, and looks like work. The job is what you do when you are told what to do. The job is showing up at the factory, following instructions, meeting spec, and being managed. Someone can always do your job a little better, or faster, or cheaper than you can. 
The strength of the team is each individual member. The strength of each member is the team. Even though your time on the job is temporary, if you do a good enough job, your work there will last forever. I like to reinvent myself, it's part of my job. That's when I first learned that it wasn't enough to just do your job, you had to have an interest in it, even a passion for it. If you hire people just because they can do a job, they'll work for your money. But if you hire people who believe what you believe, they'll work for you with blood, sweat, and tears. The crowning fortune of a man is to be born to some pursuit which finds him employment and happiness, whether it be to make baskets, or broadswords, or canals, or statues, or songs. We don't all love our jobs every day. And doing something you have passion for, doesn't make the work part of it any easier, it just makes you less likely to quit. Any fact facing us, is not as important as our attitude toward it, for that determines our success or failure. If one advances confidently in the direction of his dreams, and endeavors to live the life which he has imagined, he will meet with a success unexpected in common hours. Every job will demand some sacrifice. The key is to avoid unnecessary sacrifice. Mothers and housewives are the only workers who do not have regular time off. They are the great vacationless class. If opportunity doesn't knock, build a door. The person who goes farthest, is generally the one who is willing to do and dare. The sure thing boat, never gets far from the shore. The greatest thing in this world is not so much where we stand, as in what direction we are moving. Only those who risk going too far, can possibly find out how far one can go. Before you build a better mousetrap, it helps to know if there are any mice out there. It does not matter how slowly you go, as long as you do not stop. I am not a product of my circumstances. I am a product of my decisions. Write your own book instead of reading someone else's book about success. Getting fired is nature's way of telling you that you had the wrong job in the first place. The future belongs to those who believe in the beauty of their dreams.